that everyone has to do with a car is a hoon or an enthusiast yeah. and yeah. there's a difference. When it's in the foreshore in town, it's contained in one area and they can watch what goes on and like, yeah they've done this, so it's not just here, they're, they're spread out all over Newcastle. The cops coming come in and just kick you out for no reason. Yeah. <laughs> defaulted to a spot that was the foreshore that has been for the last 25 years of God knows how long. You could talk to older people than myself and know that that's what they, they had done when they were our age or even younger. Um, the thing is is that in that amount of time, instead of the, the community and the police getting behind a place for people to go on Thursday nights so they can meet at a cheap sort of like venue where they can have their cars, i.e. a racetrack, a drag strip, some place where, where, where recreational um, car activities can happen. The um, MG Car Club in, in uh, Newcastle that have been fighting for something to be ha done. They actually own a piece of land and been pushing for a track for 20 years. And all the police have, have been able to do in that 20 years is block the foreshore with a piece of chain. Yeah. I don't care whether they block it off every night of the week, I will go elsewhere. Uh, no matter what they do, we're always going to end up somewhere else. I might not be called an athlete when I stand, sit behind the, the wheel of my car at the traffic lights, but come this weekend when Kingwood Park is on, I'll be competing. Um, there's a two-day hill climb. Uh, That's what I was thinking, oh, 53 years. 53 years. And every year the track gets shorter and shorter and more obstacles in the way. And it, it's happened. Now, over 53 years, obviously change happens. Right. Uh, the, admittedly, the police are on, on, usually on our side for this one. They come, they check the track, they make sure everyone's safe. It's a great day out to take the kids and the family or, or whoever wants to come to have a look. But two days a year, all that organisation and the people still don't appreciate it happening. Well, some people in, in the cross-section. Now, this attitude being pushed out across the community then forces you to, to come and ask me questions like this. Where's the problem? Why is there so many problems here? Now, again, you've been here for like 15, 20, 25 minutes and what, what's happened? Nothing's happened. And this is, happens week in and week out. Now, if that warrants having having seven or eight squad cars out just to manage this every every Thursday night, why haven't they used that money to, one, educate the people, to get them a, another place, uh, something better maybe even, so that we don't upset the, the neighbours over here? You, you've got to understand that not everybody are athlete swimmers or athlete bike riders or you know like sitting home and watching TV or whatever. Some of us actually like taking a car, meeting up, taking down a strip, and measuring how fast it goes, whatever. I.e. All, all the normal things. Listening to you know things spool up like that. You know, that's what we do. But if the uh, if a cross section of the um, the local government choose to ignore that and then push the push the agenda and use the local law enforcement agency to to police that, what do you end up with? You end up with kids all over the place. And not just here, they're going that way down towards um, Dixon, they're probably in town, up down the main street. Um, they're all over the place. Yeah, Kura Gang. And um, that's why, that's what all our squad cars do, or like all the highway patrol cars do on a Thursday night. I'm able to come out, hang around with mates, look at cars that have, people have put a fair bit of money and effort into it, just appreciate fucking the work. It's good until we get all the come in. These little fucking faggots get in here. Like that. <laughs> we park our cars, that's what the wrong thing is. We park there and we park there. smash it's it up. Right. You get your hoons though. P players and they've only just got their license and showing off in front of their mates. Oh, oh, right. we're, we're classes in Newcastle here. Yep. The high ace. Is it running on 20 frames? That's because um, all the people in the potted up cars and burn it around the house. And all the little shit box. Yeah, yeah, suspect. It's 40 k's along here and he's doing something. Oh, mates, but we come here to socialise and we do our stuff on the track. <laughs> 